and Asedra Mayfield tells us some say they simply can't afford it. Another assessment, we can't afford it. Larissa Ballard lives in Potterville and says over the years the city council has taxed her and other residents repeatedly. I went from having maybe a $30 water bill to almost $90 a month. So when she received this letter in the mail about a possible new special assessment to fund public safety, she was fed up. They are a lot more than nickel and diming us to death. I mean, they are dollar billing us to death. Under the proposed special assessment to the tune of $10 a month or $120 a year. Our tax structure, like a lot of other cities, has continued to go down. We find that we don't have anything else to cut except uh, public safety at this point. Rodney Ross is the mayor of Potterville. He says if approved, the special assessment would generate about $100,000 to help continue the city's police, fire, and ambulance services. This special assessment would affect every household in, in Potterville. While Ballard isn't in favor of another assessment, the city will have to make cuts without it. And she worries without public safety, her home insurance rates will spike. Paying for the special, special assessment is going to be less than paying for an increase in my insurance. But she's worried if approved, this special assessment wouldn't be the city's last. It's getting out of hand and something needs to be done. Ballard and other concerned residents will have a chance to voice their concerns before city council at a June 2nd public hearing here at City Hall. In Potterville, Cedra Mayfield, 6 News.